Hello everyone, I know it's been a while, it's your boy Live Better, L-I-V-B-E-T-T-A Just want to get into another video today man, um, it's been a while Just give me my links again, go to usahomenow.com If you want to sell a property or purchase a property, you can always hit me up on there um, You know, it's been a while, it's a new year, it's 2023 you know, want to hear what people got to want to get into. Leave me comments. If anybody want to partner with me with Airbnb, you can always hit me up too. You know, I'm willing to do that. Or if you want to partner with purchasing a property, you can always hit me up. But I just wanted to drop a little jewel today. You know, it's something I've been going through. Not going through, but it's something I just started doing. I partnered with a few people. We opened up a cigar lounge called Legacy Cigar Lounge. Go also check that out at LegacyCigarLounge.com. Um, but what I want to say is, um, a lot of people want to start, you know, opening up businesses and stuff like that. And I think sometimes what is smart to do and what it was to come up is if you could find someone that's closing down a business and you could just take it over. I think that is a great thing to do because when you do stuff like that, you're already purchasing an existing business already operating stuff like that a lot of times when you purchasing or not purchasing when you open up a business and start from the beginning it's very hard you know very very hard you know in the beginning unless you got a lot of money a lot of credit it's very hard so my advice for people if you want to start a business or open up a business is to try to find an existing business that's closing down or they want to sell their business I think that is a great way to get into owning a small business and you take over somebody's business because it's already operating, you're already generating revenue and I think that's a, a smart move, you know, we just did that, we just um, opened up a cigar lounge and um, we're not, we're, well yeah, opened it up, somebody had it before us and they closed down and we just took it over, it was much easier, it already had a flow, it's already been there, stops for years, you know. And um, we had just got into another business. It didn't cost much to start up. You know, we just had to come out of pocket with like 4200 for rent security. And it was already an existing business there. You know, and I'm, I mean, that's not all the costs that we had to do. Like, we had to still buy inventory. We still had to, you know, we wanted to fix it up a little bit more, stuff like that. So it still costed us more money. But to me, it was a better move than starting a business from scratch. Like starting a business from scratch, man, I always say this, it's like having a baby. You gotta, you gotta hold it, rock it, feed it, always be by, by a baby. You know, a baby can't just be left alone. You gotta do that until that baby gets to start talking, start to crawling, start to walking. And that, that takes a few years, right? That takes a couple years to get a kid from, from birth to talking and walking and eating on his own. That takes a few years to do all that type of stuff. And to me, that's the same thing with a business. A lot of times with a business, it takes a few years to really get it going where it can be automated, where you can step back and let the business run itself, you know? A lot of times we open up businesses and we let the businesses, we let the businesses run us. Instead of, instead of us running the business, we let the business run us and a lot of time that lead to us working 10, 15 hour days, seven days a week, being exhausted. And then what happens a lot of times, you know, the first year, they always say first year businesses fail, you know, because it takes so much in the beginning to do so, you know. So what I'm saying to people is, look, if you can find an existing business that's already there and somebody wants to sell it or maybe the owner may have passed away and the Kids want to get rid of it. That's a that's a good way to get into a small business, you know. So I just wanted to drop that little jewel, little gem on people today. You know, that's just coming from experience. You know, find a business that's closing down and open it back up, man. It can be a good move. You know, people, you can always check me out at usahomenow.com. That's my website if you want to purchase or sell a property. Check out my cigar lounge, LegacyCigarLounge.com. Shout out to my boys, Russ, Chris, and Aaron, and my partners with it. Shout out to them. Peace.